Hello, good day. Today is my birthday, so I'll ask you just one gift. Allow me the opportunity to explain why I am posting, why it seems that I may have a, an obsessive compulsive disorder with Israel, the Jews, and Islam. Many of you may know me, many of you grew up with me, some of you just met me. Understand very well, I believe in the Bible. I believe it's the Word of God. I will not apologize for believing that. All things that the Bible has said have come true. And what is to come, what is written, will eventually come through. True as the Word says. Understand very well, I made a trip to Israel just to be sure of what I'm saying, to be sure I'm not spreading lies and propaganda. Understand this also. Many countries have conquered and kept what they conquered. Uh, when I look at Argentina and uh, England fighting over the Falkland Islands, you have to say it's something st stupid, right? But it's not even in their territory. Now, we want to blame Israel and blame the Jews and those of you that are Christians should understand what I'm saying. If you've read the Bible, from Genesis to Revelation, it mentions Jews. It mentions Israel. It mentions the Holy Mount Zion. It mentions Jesus returning on the Mount of Olivet. Understand this. The 12 tribes will be restored. Yes. Understand this. You call Israeli settlers on their land colonies. You call them settlers. If I should rent an apartment from you, or if I should rent an apartment to you, and I should tell you, hey, everything is yours except the toilet, the bedroom, and the kitchen. What do you have? You have nothing. How can it be that Israel is on their land and they cannot be sovereign on their land. They have to leave pieces of land here and there to Arabs. Some people say Palestinians, but they themselves refer to themselves as Arab Palestinians. Well, where do Arabs, Arabs come from? Arabs, as far as I know, comes from Saudi Arabia. That's where Arabs come from. They conquered a lot of land, even up to North Africa, Morocco, Algeria, Tunisia were held by people called Kabil or Berber. Many people conquered many nations. Right now, the Europe, European nation, uh, Union is condemning Israel on many grounds, in many things. But who has ever condemned Europe that did things in times past? Uh, don't take it as an offense, my American friends. But Europeans came over. They conquered Northern United, uh, Northern uh, America, created the United States and Canada, and they butchered and slaughtered many Indians. I'm not saying there should be reparation. We can't make amends for the past. We can only look towards the future. But what I'm saying here is that many Indians were killed, the land taken, and then what happened? Slaves brought to work. I'm not making this a racial issue. I'm just showing you we need to be just in what we do. If we, before we point fingers, we should point fingers at ourselves. Europe colonized the whole world. As far as India, China, Latin America, the Caribbean, Africa. Many big countries in Europe still exploit lands, buying territories in Africa.